I have had to take a mentor who just wasn't getting along with their trainee. The trainee was asking questions, sometimes hypothetical, and the mentor was very literal. The mentor didn't understand why the trainee wasn't getting it. When in reality, the trainee was understanding. The trainee just wanted to understand at a different level. Hypothetically, if this happened and this happened and this happened, well, that'll never happen. When did that happen? I don't remember that happening. Moving that employee to a different mentor who was wired the same way. At the end of that mentorship program, both of those employees and both of the mentors were better off. Make your mentors part of your onboarding program. Build them into your process. Make sure your incoming employees meet your mentors face to face, especially as a lot of places move to remote work. You want to make sure that you have employees and mentors, employees and managers meeting face to face. Maybe you can only do that through a video interaction. It's very important to make sure you get FaceTime with people, seeing how they react. So when you're doing a text chat communication, you know who you're talking to.